A report just released from MD Anderson this morning. Researchers looked at the largest group of women with breast implants that's ever been studied. Now they found there's a higher risk of rare diseases among these women than in those without implants. Health reporter Haley Hernandez is here to explain this health alert. Good morning. Good morning, guys. So MD Anderson tells me there's always been a small risk associated with breast implants, and ideally patients know that before getting the procedure done for cosmetic or reconstructive purposes. But now MD Anderson has a warning for everyone after researching the largest study ever with 100,000 women. MD Anderson Cancer Center says they have found silicone breast implants are associated with an increased risk of some rare diseases and cancers. So some of the rare diseases that we saw were uh, lupus, uh, Sjogren's, autoimmune diseases. Uh, that have been previously shown. Dr. Mark Clemens reviewed data from women with smooth silicone implants from two manufacturers, the only companies in existence where data was available at the time of the study. He reiterated the FDA says implants are safe. But according to the study, one group of patients had illnesses like rheumatoid arthritis and melanoma twice as frequently as the general population. Silicone implants were uh, associated with common diseases and some rare diseases. Uh, it wasn't possible to say who was most at risk, but this is important information for physicians to know because if they do encounter one of these very rare occurrences, that they anticipate it and they know how to send the patient for further evaluation. Dr. Clemens says physicians and patients need to have an in-depth conversation before getting breast implants. This is important for both cancer patients and the cosmetic patients in the long term. You know, former cancer patients may get care for an additional 10 years, while cosmetic patients rarely go in for that long-term follow-up or revision. Dr. Clemens says implants are not a lifetime device. Most of the time, they need to re have a revision. You need to go back and talk to your doctor, and you need to disclose to your doctor if you've ever had implants before because in theory if these diseases are very rare right. they could be missed absolutely yeah. right important information local study absolutely yeah thank thanks you. guys